Final year on the ice. This is our outdoor rink. Yay! We start off new. Ready? What? I know this is that. Columbia Art Eastern. This is Milana's first time on the ice. Okay, we'll be right back. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Melly Mel, her first time on the ice ever. Doo -doo -doo. She's doing good. The ice rink is open and I'm finally skating. Yay! This guy, the ice is really, really good, actually. Really great. Really smooth. I was afraid I was uh, gonna find some slush, but none of it. And it's enormous, so there's like room for everyone here to do whatever the hell you want so I think it's pretty awesome so these are the surroundings my skate's starting to hurt me that I brought my little ankle pad with me but uh this is what it looks like outside still no snow whatever slush you see is from uh um putting the ice on this field i don't know if it's i don't think it's a soccer field but they had tennis courts and random stuff over here so it's all been converted into an ice rink so pretty big and cool <laughs> hey guys, well, I'm uh, finally back from my first time skating outdoors ever. It's um, November 6th. Temperature, I think, is uh, around 40, 40-ish. And they're actually able to keep an ice rink outside. And uh, the temperature, I think, was absolutely perfect. Um... 10 minutes into my skating, I was already ready to shed all the clothes that were on my back. I was drenched in sweat. Mm. But I have to say I had a great, great time. I've been waiting for months on end for this day to come, for me to finally be able to skate. And it's so unfair because they have a couple of indoor ice rinks here but people aren't allowed to skate in it unless you play hockey so i've literally been um seriously considering joining a freaking hockey team i don't even know if girls can even join the hockey team but if that's the only way i can get on the ice well then that's what i have to do uh off season of course um now the outdoor skating rink is open and it's probably like three indoor skating rinks combined that's how big it is you can have several hockey games going on at one time and uh, figure skaters practicing at the same time as well. 
And I'm a little surprised that the sport isn't bigger here because while I was skating and practicing and just kind of trying to get used to the things I know again, all I did was uh, kind of skate for an audience of little girls and ladies that were on the ice with their kids. I mean, there is a real interest in figure skating and I can completely see it. Uh, but um, to expect maybe like coaching for somebody like me, an adult, or skating uh, beyond, I don't know, maybe basics, I don't know if, um, if that will ever be possible here. And I am really, really missing my ice skating coach right now. I really do miss him. He taught me so much and um, I still had so much to learn and have so much to learn. So I don't know exactly how I'm going to learn anything new or perfect what I already know, but I have a rink to practice in now. So maybe I'll uh, be risky and get it. Once I got on the ice, I was a little shaky and, well, I guess you would say very rusty because it's been, actually, I haven't put foot on ice this entire year and that's uh, very strange for me. And I do look like crap because I, this is how I look when I finished exercising <laughs> and I did really exercise on the ice. I did a lot of exercises and my muscles hurt my feet hurt um there's a, an area on my ankle that my skate my good skates kind of like a rub on and i didn't put my ankle um band on on time and i have kind of like a little scab <laughs> but i think i did pretty good about um maybe an hour i felt a little more secure and um, started kind of like a practicing what I know and I started get, gaining more confidence. So that's really good. Um, I was going to go for a run today and I'm glad I decided not to because I probably would not have um, had the energy to skate like this. It's just uh, obviously a different set of muscles that I'm using and I would have been worn out so I'm kind of glad I didn't um I'm gonna try to go on the on the rink a couple of times a week so today it was actually they didn't make anybody pay because there were like kind of like I think a few people not enough there um so it was free of charge <laughs> um and that was cool. That was cool because it's like uh, 50 crones to to skate for the whole day. Which actually isn't bad because they have places to barbecue and they have food and stuff like that. So, um, God, it's so cozy. I loved it. And skating and the open air. I've never done that before in my life and I thought it was great. So, um, I don't have that, didn't have that many clips because I didn't, Bring my well we brought the camera but we forgot the battery mm. so all I had was my husband's phone and that's all I used um, so yeah that's it it was a blast um, the whole family had a great great time and Melania did really good on her first lesson because I did give her lessons today and she is uh, learning really quickly so I'm really proud of her um, she has all the skate gear because of my kids. Um, well, the, the skating gear that my kids have obviously doesn't fit them anymore. And they've been skating since they were really little. So um, all that has been handed down to our little girls. So she has skates. She has tights. She has little dresses. She's just in heaven, in heaven on the ice. But... Um, I think she did really good for her first lesson and I think I did really good for, um, I don't know, like uh, almost a year that I haven't been skating. So yes, finally, finally, oh yeah, and I'll try to, um, I don't know, post whatever stuff I can post um, when I'm there because I it's really hard to 
videotape stuff when you're on the ice. So. Okay, um, just a little quick update. I hope everyone's having a wonderful weekend and we're still having a wonderful weekend. My husband is um, helping out a friend actually and the little girl has a play date. So I had a little time to sit here and chit chat about my amazing day because this was an amazing day for me. I feel so free when I'm on the ice. So I will talk to you guys soon.